Miguel and Ronnie deep here in the iBot vaults, and we're going to look at some more boxing odds. We've got some random boxing odds popping up all over the world here, and uh, we've done a couple of odds for the shows at the Echo Arena and obviously the DC Armory show, but we're going to cover some odds from uh, all over the place. Opening the night up here, checking out odds uh, Saturday, April 2nd here in Mexico. Former champion, former two-weight class world champion, Johnny Gonzalez returns. He's a huge favorite, minus 6,000, facing Justin Savvy, plus... 2000 Gonzalez fighting his 70th professional fight at the end of his career, but still maybe looking for one last hurrah there. And uh, this is a bounce back fight, basically designed to get him a win down there in Acapulco. The Velasco Theater, uh, Oscar De La Hoya and Golden Boy are back with their LA Fight Club series. Uh, that's going to air on Australia TV. They've got a pretty tough, a pretty good main event here between uh, Manuel Avila, who's a minus 2105 favorite over Rene Alvarado, plus 10.35. It's in the featherweight division at 10 rounds. Usually competitive matches on these Belasco theater cards. We'll see how this one plays out. The most competitive line on paper comes uh, to us from uh, the Hartwall Arena in Helsinki, Finland. Heavyweights, that's why it's important because uh, we know Johan de Hoopas, he was uh, prior to uh, Deontay Wilder defending his belt against Arthur Spilka, De Hoopas was his last opponent. And uh, he's a plus 200 underdog facing undefeated Robert Helenius. Helenius from Finland, he's at minus 280. And this has got a vacant WBC uh, silver belt on the line. So this puts them in play as potential contenders for Deontay Wilder's belt. And um, like I said, that one's a competitive line. I expect Helenius to come out of there with the win in the hometown kind of thing. De Hoopas. He's lost a couple of fights here, and uh, he's probably making his way into that status of uh, doorman and journeyman for guys heading upwards in the rankings. Anyway, those are some loose odds all over the place, including some details on the heavyweights. Coming up this uh, Saturday, April 2nd, and I'm Miguel Adorati here. We've been talking shoot. Talk to you after these fights.